Now turn to that deadly drag racing accident and the problem overall of drag racing and drifting growing in Chicago. Fox 32's Nate Rogers is live on the far south side in West Pullman where Nate you just spoke with the victims families and a vigil is underway. Nate. Yeah, that's exactly right, Natalie and Anthony. I mean, it's still exactly unknown what caused this crash um, or if there was a second vehicle involved. Family members of at least two of the victims just left the scene here after leaving behind flowers and candles. Of course, those family members heartbroken and asking questions tonight. How, how are you going to remember your brother? How we can get. He had a lot of dreams. This was a scene overnight, a vehicle engulfed in flames. Police say officers were already dispatched to the area following reports of drag racing. The vehicle somehow lost control. Officers witnessed it hitting a wall before catching fire. Three people here lost their lives, including Jose Manuel Velasquez and Jonel Gutierrez, both 18 years old and graduates of East Aurora High School. My brother was at the back. He didn't have control of the wheel. I'm pretty sure he did. He, this, not, this was not going to happen. You're shocked by this? I am. The horrific crash happening overnight right here at 100th and Halsted, just a block away from well-known funeral home Gatlin's Chapel. Uh, the neighborhood itself is pretty quiet, but Halsted is definitely a busy street. Uh, we don't necessarily have our occurrences of drag racing per se, but you do have your re your reckless drivers because this is a major street, major highway. Crews were seen assessing the damage the scorched vehicle left behind. Family members lit candles on top of roses, remembering lives gone too soon. He had a lot of, a lot of dreams, you know, he wanted to finish college, get a house, and, and now it's just, you know, memories. Again, now, we do know that there were at least five people inside of the vehicle at the time. Three of those folks did die. Chicago police continue to investigate this crash in the West Pullman neighborhood. I'm Nate Rogers, Fox 32, Chicago.